for dream ups and glamour items that earn you extra time and points. At the end of each world, one piece of Barbie's enchanted ball gown ensemble will be waiting for you. Collect them all, and Barbie's off to the fantasy ball with Ken. Barbie's counting on you. This is Barbie's dreamland. Barbie dreams about some weird shit. This is amazing. <laughs> I'm waiting here for. Oh, I'm not finishing that sentence. Never mind. I'm seeing there's anything. Anytime Barbie encounters an obstacle, she loses Z's on the dream meter, and the more Z's she loses, the closer she gets to waking up from her wonderful dream. Once Barbie loses all her Z's, the game ends. At this point, you can choose to send Barbie back to her dream at the level you left off, or let Barbie wake up. AC Fan mentions a good point. He's like, what the fuck? The game has really smooth walking cycles, but everything else looks terrible. Yeah. That's where all the budget went. <laughs> I'm going to make sure everyone sees every frame of them moving in, uh, walking perfectly, but everything else will look terrible. All right, let's see here. There are secret bonus rooms and hidden charms and stages throughout the dream world. To get into bonus rooms, press the control pad down arrow or left arrow at special areas in each stage. To exit bonus rooms, go to the left side of the room and press down. Some B blocks contain Barbie coins for Zs and points. Can you help Barbie find them? This is... This is... So I've got three charms that I can attack. There's that burnt Barbie again. Charm. I got three attacks. There's the bow charms, which make a friend stop. Diamond charms make a friend move. And heart charms sometimes make a friend do something extra special. <laughs> can I just tell you what Lucas just tweeted? She's guys, I'm not going to be home in time. I'm on a goddamn plane. Stop blowing up my Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I've, I've got to stop reading this. This is... There are six fucking st There are more than six stages in this game. Yes, there are. And there are bosses. There are bosses? Yes, there are. <laughs> Alright, enough, enough fucking around. Let's get real. Once upon a dream. <laughs> Do we watch that horror horrific intro again? <laughs> so, the uh, United States House of Representatives have to had to watch the intro at one point. What? I'm sorry, what? The, the, um, this, the, uh, part of the reason this game was really notable and I was excited to find it is, um, this was a video game that was used in a very large court case about counterfeit games from Taiwan. And they watched this cutscene from, I think, four or five different cartridges at the very least to prove that the company in Taiwan was legitimately counterfeiting this game. <laughs> John, just so you know, you are now above Mario Kart 8 and Super Smash Brothers for the Wii U. What the actual <laughs> fuck? <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's get to. Oh, I can make the text go faster. Thank God. This is the, this is a new eSport. <laughs> Barbie the eSport. Yes. I can see it. All right, we're we're playing. Yay, sports! Boom, baby said the stages are really short. The game is about 30 minutes, even if you don't know what you're doing. What? <laughs> It's a super short game. All right, well that's good it, at least. It oh, was oh god damn it! Don't tell me that means we're gonna beat the game tonight. Please yeah, don't like, tell me that's what that means. Let me put it this way, John. It was so short. It was remade and they added content for the Game Boy release. I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> what? What is this tennis racket bullshit? What is happening yep. here? Do I have to get the dog to do something? Why do I have a sudden urge to make a tumbler, even though I promised I never would? Don't make a tumbler. I'm go, probably. my dog minion. Go, go, the dog oh, minion. Oh, that actually is what I was supposed to do. Holy shit, that was a puzzle. Nice. I solved the puzzle in Barbie, guys. I don't know you how to feel about thing. this. Come back here, B-Coin. This is fuck. Part. You're right. This is straight yeah. out of Bart versus the Space Mutants. The font and everything. Yeah. Um, so this company also made games like Fisher Price Firehouse Rescue for the NES. Um, A Boy and His Blob was among their, along their list of, of things they made, right? Uh, I just wanted to point out the last games they made were Home Improvement for the Super Nintendo and Penn and Teller's Smoke and Mirror. What? Are you fucking serious? Yes. They made Desert Bus? <laughs> Yes. That's incredible. 
Imagineering, the, the team in Imagineering and the same people were on the team the entire time ended up making Desert Bus. Along with, obviously, the rest of that video game. That is incredible. Um, so, and, and the thing is, right, that was only four years after this Barbie game. In four short years, you go from this to Desert Bus. And Home Improvement, so, you know. Home, home Improvement was at least fun. This is true. Nonsensical, but fun. I mean, granted, if you think about it, right, all of, all of those, like, you know, the, the Simpsons games for the NES, um, Attack of the Killer Tomatoes, uh, Fighting Oh, God, they Trooper. did that, too? Oof. Yep. They did The Adventures of Rocky and Bullwinkle. Uh. Uh, they did Ghosts of Ghoul School and Family Dog. So they like, made the... Family Dog. Yeah. Oh my for the Super God. Nintendo. So, like, all of these games have very... Si now, now that you talk about it, they are all exactly the same in, in some aspects. How's the Desert Barbie? <laughs> oh, my God, never. Uh, Desert Barbie for, for not hope. Not hope. Desert Barbie, no. Go, Kitty! Go is, I, is, I, is this how I fight this boss? Do I just throw the cat at it? Possibly? It's a super easy game, from what I've heard. Oh, I... I guess this is obscure to anyone who doesn't watch Desert Bus for Hope. Desert Bus is a game where you drive in real time on a bus that goes 30 miles an hour from Tucson, Arizona to Las Vegas, Nevada. It takes about eight hours, and then all that happens is you get a point and go the opposite direction. The thing is, you might be saying, why can't you just hold A? The bus leans to the right. right. Yes. So if you just hold A, eventually the bus will hit the side of the road and stop. The and only then... positive thing that comes out of this is Desert Bus for Hope by Loading Ready Run every November. They raise, like, I think last year they raised like $550,000 or something for Child's Play. You're, you're you missing key parts of the yeah. You're Okay, it's 55 miles an hour. Sometimes you get bugs in the windshield. And if you screw up, if you screw up, you get towed back. You in get to real awesome. time. In, in real, real time. time. And then you get to start again. Oh, I found just... a secret area. It's full of bees. Bye. Bees! <laughs> Not the bees! <laughs> and from what Juker has told me in the game that came out this last year, Roundabout, um, there am I, is... Am I fighting a dress right now? Yeah. <laughs> I just, I just want to make boss, sure. The, the bosses are like cloth, clothing items. For the most part. In Roundabout... I can't, I can't say I'm shocked. Uh, there is an achievement in that game to do the Desert Bus Challenge, which is doing Desert Bus in Roundabout. Um, for the chat, people in the chat asking what the point of Desert Bus is, it was made in a game called Penn & Teller Smoke & Mirrors, which is a video game version of their Cruel Tricks video, the, the old VHS tape they had circulating a while ago. Um, it's a video game version. So what you do is you say, hey, here, friend, play this awesome video game. Um, and none of them are awesome <laughs> at all. <laughs> They're all purposely very, very horrible. It's a, It never actually officially came out. Uh, it's unreleased, but people found copies of it, obviously. To um, be fair, I've never seen the other games. I've only ever seen Desert Bus. Uh, Desert Bus is the only notable one, really. Yeah, the rest of them were the rest of them were bad. Apparently, one game was actually like good out of the set, but no one talks about it. It's the one where the beat 'em up. Oh yeah, I, yeah. I think, um... I think that's supposed to be good. I can't remember. Oh. Have we determined what you're actually attacking with in this game? No. Uh, magic charms. Oh, okay. I think that was the one with the gorilla with the beat 'em up. Maybe there's one. I thought that was one where we play as Penn and Teller. Oh, what's your sign? I think it's the one you play Pancho. It's weird. The whole thing is super weird. There's also an RPG in there. Um, <laughs> right, I, mean, I forgot Desert... that, too. You mean yeah, Desert a... Bus wasn't the RPG? No, no. Desert Bus was the simulator. <laughs> they covered all genres. It's it's an amazing... It's an Can amazing you imagine game. leveling up the Desert Bus, like, as an RPG? <laughs> Slowly adding better and better things. You finally, get <laughs> the alignment fixed. You add some nitrous. <laughs> nitrous... <laughs> Definitely being attacked by fish. Miles an hour. You are. Is her are her hands above her head? What? It looked like her hands were just above her head for a second there. They were not. They are still stationary at the bottom. Because she is Barbie. This is you could you you're, you're like a quarter of the way through the game already. Wait, what? <laughs> really? 
Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. I feel we're, like we're I actually like, going to beat this game tonight, aren't we? I feel like you could speedrun this game. I don't want to speedrun this game. Oh, come on. I've always joked that I want to speedrun a terrible game. I don't want to be the person who speedruns a Barbie game. Can you imagine going to AGDQ for this game, Joe? I you can, know you want to. It horrifies me. Oh man, Imagineering is such a good company. I can tell. They make high quality games, such they as this. They make the best. They make just the the best games. The reason I keep bringing up a boy in his blob um, is because the uh, the animators are the same for the two games, right? So boy in his blob has like really good animations for some things, and some things are just god awful, and you can kind of see what happens. Good walking animation, um, but she throws things like you know. If like, she, took, she, she took a Valium and needed to throw something. She throws things like a Game Boy camera slideshow. <laughs> I never thought in my life I would hear a comparison like that, but I guess that works. And it makes sense, too, is the sad thing. That's <laughs> the worst part. Are you, are you fighting a waterfall? I Does guess. that water actually harm you? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know if I want to find out. Oh, okay, no, it's just an obstacle. It Looking seems like a past. safe bet if it's actually going to hurt me. Uh, everything will hurt you. I've only got three Zs left because I've started tanking damage. Damage boosting? Barky's a tank. This is 25th on Twitch, ahead of Mario Kart 8, Day Z, and behind Wings of V. Jesus. Who's playing Wings of V? Is it man? Uh, He's been up for like 60 hours at this point, I think, playing Wings of V. So it is man versus game? It is man. All right. Wow. That's He's been up since, like, Wednesday night, I think. She's a now, that's a guy I would like to meet. I'd like to meet Man vs. Game. Because I, I can yeah. highly respect what he tries to do. He is insane for... Well, yes, that too. Like, at one point he had a schedule, like, every day, like, 8 a.m. or sometimes 8 p.m., whenever. Now he's just like, I'm going to stream for, like, four days. Okay, <laughs> yeah, bro. that's also really fucking crazy. I would never be able to do yeah. that. That's, it's... Like I said, I think he's been streaming since, like, Wednesday night. <laughs> well, now I'm at the food court. There are pizzas rolling at me. <laughs> yep, this this is a dream. Pizza roll. And now there's a bouncy palm. <laughs> bouncy palm tree Alec, here. Alec, uh, yes. Uh, the creator of Boshi, or Boshi, if you're supposed to say it, um, created Wings of V. His name is Solgren. Oh, yeah. He is named after Danish oatmeal. What did I just get? I have an orbital around me. An, I, You know? I have a shield. Yep, that's what it looks like. You got you got yourself a power-up, oh John. God. <laughs> thing moves really fast. It's fucking Gradius now, man. <laughs> You're on it. You are on it. Oh my god. I Sorry, I just turned on man stream to see where he was in Wings of V. He's been in the exact same screen since when I woke up this morning at 8 in the morning. Oh my god. He has not made progress in like seven, like 15 hours. That's, in, that's intense. I'm not saying that's like him being a bad gamer. I'm saying that game's hard. Wings of V is incredible. Like... Yeah, I think I put it on my uh, my list for like my wish list on Steam. They don't have it. It looks like a really good. Game. And now that John's gone silent, I'm worried he's actually grabbing it right now. No. I'm sure he okay, is. thank I want, I want to get it really bad, but um, I won't <laughs> put anyone through that. I love how I trolled like people during Christmas because I gave a bunch of my friends like games for Christmas, but I on purpose cleaned up my uh, my list for like my wish list so people would not be able to actually like get me anything yeah, yeah i noticed that i i got a good laugh out of it i know i can't remember i know i got you postal too you did which is funny because i was trying to gift it to you <laughs> i already own postal too and i can't remember i got you something else what else did i get you john you are fighting pizza ovens look like yep uh, fighting pizza ovens what the hell else did i get you john i don't remember Oh. oh. It was... Um, I'm throwing away my magic Barbie coins. Am I wishing for this dress? 
Is this what's happening right now? Maybe. Yep, I sure did. A toucan is delivering address to me. All right, Tamar got my talisman. I forgot about that. And Stevie will ask, yes, I am. We've just this, that's been on the back burner for a long time now at this point. All right, time to go to the beach. Apparently, I wonder what it'd be like to be a mermaid. You're gonna find just like out. the one in my book. Is this stage two? Did, after all that, are we only at stage two? Let me read through this, this book. Maybe I, there's only like only a few stages. Hang on. Hang on, I've got the book. John, you're making me go through my store purchases oh, on Steam. Oh, Damn my it. mistake. Um, where I said there were six stages, those were all just the mall. <laughs> oh. So there are um, two mermaid stages. There's a Then there's uh, two fabulous 50s soda shop stages. Uh, or sorry, there are three, and then that's all the manual says. So I we're over halfway done this game already. Musical emergency. Thank you for resubbing. Oh, I got you slender. Oh, oh right. Slender the arrival. I got, I got to swear I got you slender. I can't remember what it was. Musical emergency. Thank you for subbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. I got people for Christmas. I got G Science Girls, the most anime game I could find on well, Steam. Didn't he jokingly put as many anime girls as he could find on he, his list too? He did, so I bought him one. I think I did too, actually. <laughs> Go, Dolphin. Do whatever you're supposed to do. Oh, you're a, a star man. Okay. And you're also auto-playing the game for me. Also, thank you. I'm seriously not holding the controller anymore. Could not be easier. Barbie. Barbie's a video game. I'm also trying to figure out how in the world to pilot Barbie. She's very, very ridiculously hard to... Pilot, apparently. That is definitely considered a wall. All right. Yep. So jump is now. God damn it, Devin. <laughs> John, don't make don't make mention on stream that you're wanting a game. Haha. -ha. Thank you, Vincent. <laughs> Yay for not being you and having people hate me. <laughs> um, because John. Only people who hate you buy you that game. Which which John? The, the German fat ass. Oh, so what's you? You should uh, check your last tweet. Huh? Did you do the you bot? No, no. The link he tweeted was all sorts of wrong. Oh, thank you. <laughs> My B. But thank you. I didn't like link something horrible. I linked the yeah. wrong. It tab was, of Ask it FM. Was, no, it was just it was the most hardcore thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I feel I feel like my grandmother would be rolling in her grave. It was instead of my profile of Ask FM, I linked to everyone's own wall on Ask FM. Nice. Go yep. ask yourself a question. Has it <laughs> I, I can't. I think this thing's gonna hurt me because it started playing like the Jaws theme. Yeah, whatever. I mean, it's Sometimes a jellyfish. It makes sense. Casually, place the casually just play the Jaws theme. Vince, Wings of V is a game that Solgren made intending for people to fucking destroy their lives over, pretty much. Yeah. He made it incredibly difficult. There's also a difficulty called Doom Mode, I think, which makes everything a one-hit kill. Ugh. Instead of which having proper... Difficult. Which means somebody is going to speed run it. On that Someone's oh, already you know. playing through it. I forgot who Man said was doing it, but wasn't, someone is. Wasn't there a speed run of it at AGDQ? I thought it was on the v. PC block. V no, V hadn't been out long enough. I don't think. Uh, I will check though. Games done quick. Com slash schedule. I thought for sure I saw it there, but I also could have imagined that. It's entirely possible. Summer oh, Games no. Done Quick uh, dates got announced, so that's cool. Yeah, it's at, was it uh, Minnesota? Yep. Minnesota. Yep, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Which means I have I run a chance of being able to attend. Nice. It Like I said at MagFest, it's weird. K-Head kind of made me not want to go. Why? It seems like I 
wouldn't ha it's nothing he said it's it kind of just seems like i wouldn't have as good of a time as i thought and that it's kind of like watching a major sporting event it, it seems makes, cool makes sense yeah. seems cool in person but it's just really kind of nicer to watch it in your on your couch or on in your own home i really hope i was actually supposed to not see anything there no you yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure you weren't it's a dream Everything's a dream. Keon, uh, Summer Games on Quake is in, in Minneapolis. Also, the only game that had the word wings in it that was at as uh, AGDQ was Pilot Wings. All right, never mind. I'm crazy. Dude, Pilot Wings is an amazing game. All right, the pearls were health, not the... Oh, Comic Sense is speedrunning Wings of E. Comic Sense? Comic Sense. And Bananasaurus Rex. Oh fuck, I, I hope this thing doesn't immediately kill me, otherwise... Get the fuck off me, whatever. Alright, stupid jellyfish. Like, I guess that's a guaranteed hit. Uh-oh, I'm down to my last Z. I've made a terrible mistake! Oh no! Oh, I'm fine. Quick, somebody start typing. Get some more Z's in there. So unmash your Frank keyboard. Your Z. Don't don't Rip encourage chat. <laughs> Your Man. chat's now dead. Yep. Thank you, John. Appreciate yep. that. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I found the giant letter B. Made out of starfish. Am Is I at an auto scrolling point picking up the letter the word Barbie? In Possibly. in out of starfish? What is the hitbox? For Barbie! What is it's her hitbox no. for picking up it, shit? Listen, it, listen, it, it actually it, looks like your chest. It's her boobs! It is her boobs! That is the hitbox! It is one pixel one pixel in your chest. You are playing Gradius. <laughs> I like I love the fact that there is just stars spelling out Barbie right there. I didn't realize you were playing Mario World. Barbie dreams of her own name, apparently. Is this where I'm supposed to be? I guess it's auto doing this now. A true girl's hitbox for boobs. <laughs> guess I'm in this uh, sandcastle now. And it's shooting tornadoes at me. Go, seahorse, do my bidding. Someone simply asked me on Ask FM, what the hell, dude? Makes sense to me. <laughs> am am I supposed to not be able to go up? Now I can go up. Why? What the fuck? I am so confused right now with with the controls in this game. Because some of the things are solid walls and some of them aren't. Someone asked, "Are you in underwater Egypt?" Um, I yeah, I no? feel like that. Nope, it's underwater Egypt. Confirmed. Now I've got my shield. Fuck it, we're powering. Oh, shield's gone. Okay, I guess it wasn't a Starman after all. Is this the second move, or... Is this the second movie of The Little Mermaid? Maybe. Yes. She's gonna find a spoon soon. What is going on right now? I do not understand. There we go. Under the sea. I seriously do not understand what is happening right now. The, the game is randomly throwing me around. So you've played, though, Imagineering games. you played those Simpsons games. You should understand that you don't under, you're not supposed to understand what's going on. Can I point out, I don't know whoever, who, anyone here who has not played, is it Bart versus the Space Mutants? Yes. The most fucking arbitrary thing in the world <laughs> to, so, to beat that game. Uh, the first stage, you have to get rid of all, like, these... You have to make 30 items purple or something like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, some of those things require you being at a specific part of the stage at a specific time. Yeah. And if you're not, then you fail the stage. Like, there's a it's movie theater at the very beginning of the stage, and it says come back at, like, 9 and 11. Or it says, yeah, showings at 9 and 11. You have to show up, I think, at both those times, now that I think about it. Yes. Yeah. And then you have to spray this character purple before they leave. I would like to point out Mike has changed his Twitter handle. Not his handle. 
his Twitter display name to Mike Amaretto. Nice. He is very much enjoying that. I think the only thing in video gaming I found more arbitrary than some of the Imagineering titles and like CR titles is uh, the X Men uh, side scroller <laughs> for the Genesis. Oh, the one where we have to reset the game. We have to reset the game. Oh, let me refresh Twitch and see where you're currently ranked. All right, I I am fighting a boss, but I am not actually sure how to damage it. I see like these crab king and queen that are like locked behind a door. Oh, there we go. Should know you be that are easy. pretty much you're tied with Daisy oh my God. ahead of Smash Bros. Wii U, Madden 15, and Dark Souls. 2. I I freed the crab king and queen. Yay! We're actually gonna finish this fucking game too, aren't we? You are. We're we're only just reaching time now because of how late we started this one, mm. and we're at the final stage of the game. You are. Mike, if you keep saying CS villain, she will boop punch you. Here, giant oyster, take all these pearls, but only three of them, and make a part of a dress for me. Or make one giant ass pearl ring necklace? Question mark. Oh, hello, Link to Link Gamer. Thank you. Hmm, that was fun. Oh, somebody, what the fuck? But now I'd better hurry to the soda shop. Can't be late. <laughs> Can't get it. Damn it. So I said there were three soda shop stages, right? Yeah. Oh, sweet. They. Is that a bra? Or is that supposed to be, like, masquerade glasses? Um... Yes. I want to go. I thought it was the glasses. I got a record. There's a magnet. Can I pick up the magnet, or is that a bad magnet? Oh, I, right? probably, I probably used bad. And, right, kiss for me? I spent $10 on a awful egg game, and that was fantastic. You spent 25 on this Barbie game, and it was m even more fantastic. Yeah, no, this is a this is a really good purchase. I, I I'm no. glad you guys feel that way. Yeah. <laughs> so fucking glad. Yeah, aren't you though? But my game has two positions in case one doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this game came complete in box. That's true. Really Quick, well done, neat in box too. Well, I solved the puzzle. I did it. You did the thing. There was a point so in this game where I thought I was going to actually have to use a life. I think that's <laughs> not happening anymore. I, like many others, gave John an egg. And it was glorious. No, come back, masquerade bra. Oh no, it's gone. John, you almost... Hmm? Oh, sweet. Milk Almost. is five cents. <laughs> John, 2,030 people watching Barbie. Jesus How do you Christ, feel about your guys, life right I'm now? so sorry. <laughs> I'm so... And it's almost midnight in mountain time. Oh, my God, guys. Yeah. It's almost 2 a.m. here. I'm so sorry. I can't believe it. Embrace Barbie. Em do I have to? No, yes. it'd be kind of hard and pointy. Hard and pointy? Oh, my God. Very, very plastic. Yeah. Oh, like, man, I feel especially if it was, like, one of those spinning ones that has the stupid, like, wing arms. Spinning fun. spinning Barbie? What? Yeah, no, they had these Barbies. My sister had them. That, uh, they they had, like, a ripcord and a little base, and you pulled the ripcord, and then the arms would flail out, and they had wings, and they'd spin up to the ceiling. Aren't those, like, the Winx Club things or whatever the fuck? They were many things rebranded as many other things. Uh -huh. Um, I believe there might have also been Beetleborg versions Beetleborg. Beetleborg was pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> Who remembers VR Troopers? Uh, yep. Yeah. I, I went as a VR Trooper for Halloween one year, which was not nice. A good <laughs> which was not a good costume. Oh, never mind. <laughs> no, it was not. It was like 1995. <laughs> we have started a chain of people doing Ask FM and Tumblr asks on Twitter. By the way. It is now up to me. Oh, let's see. It's, it started with Villain, and then I did it. Then Dan did it. 
Brad did it. V Vince did it. And Page of Heart has now jumped on it. <laughs> Congratulations, Villain. Villain did a thing. Oh, oh, she's man. got a little tiny poodle on her skirt. Look at that. 8-bit <laughs> poodle skirts. 8-bit poodle skirts. 10-cent sodas. Hamburgers that have eyeballs. Oh, man. Roller skates that shoot bones? Was that a bone? Yes. Hamburgers so, with eyeballs in it. Still oh. better than the burger at uh, the convention. Oh, God. That fucking... What was it? $10 burger? $8 burger? $8 burger. Uh, $8 shitty-ass hamburger. Or, yeah, cheeseburger. Oh, yeah, what, what, was it $10 chicken, like, tenders? Yeah, the chicken tenders and uh, hamburger together came into, like, 18 bucks US. Oof. Total ripoff. <laughs> Villain, I would answer pretty much anything either, but no one asked me questions because I'm not interesting. And I don't have hashtag villain's boobs. <laughs> Every time I mention him, I'm just going to mention the hashtag. One day we'll get it trending in a small small town somewhere in the middle of Canada. You can have it trending in Northwest Territories if they existed. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we forgot that story. What? So, the last day... Uh, me and Mike were at the con was Sunday. Yes. And Kasumi has every territory in Canada for Street Pass except the Northwest Territory. Oh, right. <laughs> so my, my, Ravage Talon, Mike and Chat, changes where he lives to Northwest Territories. And then Street Pass is everyone in the room at least once except Kasumi. <laughs> oh, I think he's he G like twice. He got he me got and everyone else. He got G twice. He had Otto three times. He street passed Kasumi right before he changed it, and not a single time afterwards. <laughs> um, uh, was, you, they tried for like a few hours to street pass, and whatever um, reason, I would not do. He tried for over six hours. Yeah, it's a long. All of us got it. We're just like, eh, cool. I have Northwest Territories. Yeah, I think that was the hardest one to get for Canada too. It, it could be just Otto. It doesn't exist. Oh shit, I, because I can't clear this jump, I actually might lose a life here. Oh no. Oh fuck, I think I actually am. I can't clear this fucking jump. You're serious about this, you're like, motherfucker. The, the pain, pain whale. MLG Barbie now. The pain whale, thanks for resubbing, dude, here's your egg. I'm glad you picked Barbie. You will times. give me an egg. That's time to resub. All right, let's try this Do you again. still have um, the glitched one randomly in there? I, I do. I'm I'm not that yeah, I have not been playing all the any of the random sounds, but I do have it. Uh, do I have the five nights at Freddy's one? Villain said Tom was trying to get puzzle pieces for me and picked up my DS and his rub them together going mate, mate. This doesn't look healthy. Um, what in the hell? Um, them glitch strats. Oh, you know what the best part is? I still didn't make the jump. Oh, <laughs> oh there we go. Got it that time. <laughs> Barbie's raving in midair. Barbie's having a great time. <laughs> it, she, it's, it's the super fizzy drinks lift you up. Okay, this game is asking for precision platforming in a game that should not have precision platforming. <laughs> Imagineering. I really need that record right now. Rip Northwest Territories. I think he... I think Mike had to change it back because his 3DS wasn't allowing him to update. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh I, Dark Maron 67 just subscribed. Dark Maroon? Or is it Maron? That's Maron. Two R's. You're right. Dark Maron 67. Thanks for subbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. Why, why is this car only going up and down? What is the purpose of this? There's one game I refuse. To really screw with you. Uh, I guess I can go back and get that record now? Maybe. I, I, or not? What the fuck is the point of this thing? He's gonna turn around, aren't you? Ugh. Soda, Java, milk. This is the best platforming 
ever. Villain is villain. Uh, villain admirable. is villain is villain. Yes. Villain is more than a chest. <laughs> it just somehow became her defining characteristic, according to most of the internet. Because, to be fair, she moves. helped in that. Yeah. yeah. She definitely had... was That was her own damn fault on that one. I don't think oh, she that... minds, all things considered. <laughs> think of it this way, John. This means you have a higher chance of making those jumps compared to simple jumps. Oh shit, Barbie burgers are 20 cents. <laughs> Villain is more than her shirts. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm the wearing my Magpies t-shirt right now. I love this shirt. Shit. Uh-oh. Uh, I think we're going to um, need to continue. Damon, uh, I wouldn't call that 34 because that's... No. That's a very raw burger. It's a very deadly it's one, too, apparently. It looks like someone put the pink slime from McDonald's and just threw it on a bun. Wait, why did that? What the? All right. Don't, don't question it. Okay. You're questioning it. Stop. Oh, there's that bra masquerade thing. I could really, really use a, some healing items right now. <laughs> oh, this game is so good. Rule 34 it, is not just talking about someone's chest. It, not even close. Holy crap. Yet. Yeah, someone said she rule 34 or something. I'm like, no, that's very wrong. Hot dogs, 15 cents. God. It's like this now, game was in the 80s. Would you go I'm to Barbie I'm, I'm in a 50s malt shop. Don't forget that. Would you go to Barbie AC Con? fan, I think you might get actually knocked the fuck out if you do that. Uh-oh, should I ask what he said? <laughs> he said, should I change that? I don't think you'd get knocked out. Mama said knock you out. Villain said knock you out. I've got to hang on to my Barbie attack shield. Maybe the only thing keep me alive in this giant room of french fries. Seriously, like some health. Oh my god. There's health, but there's a burger in the way. <laughs> this is the only video game in which there's health, but there's a burger in the way is applicable. Oh no, there's a letter B! Not the letter B! I think, I, I think that's a star man. I think I just picked up a star man. Lax eggs. Funny thing you say, hot dogs are like 10 bucks now. Uh, I paid 14 No! Demon eyes, no! No! Yes, Barbie's a restless sleeper. She's like, should I go back to sleep? Should I wake up? Hmm. What should you do? Bobby asks all the hard-hitting questions. Oh. I know the answer to this question. What is the <coughs> answer? Someone asked me what the worst game I ever played was, and I actually have a definitive answer for that. Nice. Insecticide. Ooh, that sounds familiar. It is a DS game that got ported to Steam, and the game is fucking horrendous. Wasn't I able to get on that thing last time? Maybe? It doesn't matter. Apparently, I could walk past the ketchup and fry or ketchup and mustard. I can't think of the worst game I've ever played. Ah, oh, fucking french fries! No! This is like the second last stage of the game. We're almost done this. This is this the second to last, or is this legit last? Ah, oh, fuck. I've already lost all my health. Oh, no. Shit, this is actually challenging. What the fuck? That difficulty ramp, man. Kaizo Barbie. Kaizo Barbie. I guess maybe it wouldn't be as bad as if I was actually paying attention to patterns, but... It would uh, also be, it'd also be better rhythm. if I could duck. Platinum rhythm. Or that bullshit yeah. could happen. All right, that's the same... I think the same way I died last time, too. Platinum I've seriously just used... Described. Sorry? Platinum, platinum Rhythm. Sorry, subscribe. Platinum Rhythm. Thanks for selling user eggs. <laughs> He's dodging <laughs> french fries. Barbie is frustrating. I have seriously used two continues now. I If I die again, we get game over and we don't finish Barbie. Can you live with this? Can you live with that knowledge in your heart? 
Mm. I mean, you probably can, all things considered, but... Can you? I... <laughs> Do you want to know the actual answer to that? The answer is probably yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's be honest here. Fucking, why do they s Ugh. Alright. Well, what's really gonna not surprise me, though, is if I, some point in the future, see a tweet from you saying, you know, it's five in the morning, I couldn't sleep, so I beat Barbie for the NES. <laughs> it's just, it was just one of those nights. <laughs> That's the thing, is it would not surprise me the least. You're like, I woke up and I was dreaming about Barbie for the NES. Guys, I routed Barbie. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes, words I've known to utter. I still don't know how the fuck to get that. Without getting hurt. Nope. Unless the patty's supposed to be, like, bouncy or something. Maybe. Alright, let's... Let's get that shield again. You need it. I really do. Oh shit. Oh, hang on, here's the dessert menu. Next year, for our poker game, instead of, like, having a normal pot, we just bring in a whole bunch of really bad video games and bet those. Oh my god. <laughs> I imagine Barbie will be, uh... Barbie will be the top seller. Alright guys, apparently this is the last stage. Nice. Thick shakes. Jump from note to note in this stage. Don't fall off or you'll go back to the beginning. It really just tells you what to do in the manual. Nice. Watch out for the falling coins. Jump carefully over the records. They These spin and pull you to the... Uh oh So tweak the right arrow lightly to stay on. Jump from record to record. Jump onto the center axle of each gear to keep... Oh, Jesus. Be careful that gears drop in a few seconds after Barbie lands on them. When you get to the jukebox boss, jump on the coins to spin them at top speed. You hear the notes get higher as the coins spin faster. Jump from the steps onto the coins to get them to spin even faster. I think Mike brings up a good point in chat. No one's mm -hmm. impeaching this game. Wait, I'm. This isn't the. This isn't a jukebox. This is an ice cream sundae. What? I'm fighting an ice cream sundae boss. I'm just. No, hold on. This is. Let's go to the place. Uh, where's my? I'm actually like, oh shit! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh! Fuck off. Game over. Oh my, what a strange dream. I wonder how it would have turned out. Something well, maybe like I'll that. dream it again tomorrow night. <laughs> what a horrible night to have a curse. Yeah, straight back to that burnt Barbie. Uh, that oh well. Oh well, we'll have to go to bed without knowing what the ending to Barbie looks like. <laughs> oh, Chad is uh, very disappointed. Yeah, like. you know what? It's been a while. I haven't played that clip in a long time. Disappointed! Disappointed! The, uh, the stream that that actually happened on, where we introduced Disappointed, was posted on the backup channel, like, last week or two weeks ago. Nice. There's a secret message slash Easter egg on the copyright screen. I didn't see it. Oh, yeah, if you do this really weird, really weird sequence of keys, you can get a secret message on the copyright screen. Oh, uh, okay. I can pull it up for you if you really want me to. If you're that invested in Barbie right now. This... <laughs> I guess? I, I remember it being kind of weird. Alright. Oh, yeah, I got pulled up. Alright. Endo text box. In fact, I could probably just paste into the Skype text box, couldn't I? There. You get that. It's like hold select and reset the console, but do not really select. And then press A, B, up, down, left, right, A, and B in five seconds or less. What? Yeah. You it's no write... different than like a, set, it's a Sonic code. Essentially. Oh, you did write it down in the chat. Hang on, let me see here. That way you can see it with your eyes. Uh, yeah. hold select and reset the console. Continue holding select at the copyright screen. You must press A, B, up, down, left, right, A, B. 
All right, let's try this. Holy shit. Oh, what? what's what's considered the copyright screen? Just the first screen? I'd imagine. Or like the Barbie one. A, B, up, down, <laughs> left, right, A, B. It's not that screen. <laughs> Evil Josh Jepsen, you beat Kaizo, but not Barbie. <laughs> All right, that, that is good. Welcome to my life. I can't seem to get the secret message. Hold select. A, B, up, down, left, right. A, B. A, B, up, down, left, right, A, B. There we go. Christine, Robert, Scott, Victor. Jeffrey Westfield, Barbie is a trademark of Mattel Inc. Is that it? Yeah, it was probably just uh, giving you the development team. Which the, let's it, be it gave me five names and That's left the, the rest of it team. in. The f okay. Cool. We, we did that. I there's was, a similar, I was expecting something funnier. There's a similar secret. Se secret? Wow. There's a similar secret for uh, the other NES game I got you in, which is just the four or three of the four development team. Because NES era. All right, let's go. Villain Back showed off a nice selection of his shirts leading to MAGFest because of Juker. Juker had a really cool idea, and I'm kind of glad Villain went through with it. She had an advent calendar of t-shirts. The true ultimate game. Not Mario Romax, not Kaizo, no Wings of E, it's Barbie. Keep in mind, like, shitty hitboxes are shitty hitboxes. Sometimes yeah. I can fuck up a game. The sad thing is, I'm... Maybe even just to mark it off my backloggery once I add it, I might just play that again, because it seemed really fast and easy. Someone even yes. tweeted me, just randomly duck and you'll probably get health from a secret room. So I should have <laughs> done that. Well, I should yeah. point out, you can't actually duck. Um... Just press down, and it'll randomly happen. Mm -hmm. You guys keeping your game on there, or are you changing it up? I'm totally keeping Tygo Drum Master. Right. Um, yeah. I'm thinking Tygo Drum Gotta Master. Gotta be fast. We're about to run out of cookie. Yeah. Tygo Drum Master. Okay, Tygo Drum Master. Uh, Magfest Mystery Game in the following five games. I just noticed the clock. Sorry, I'm gonna have to go through this fast. Dynasty Warriors Gundam. I'm gonna need someone else to remember this in case Dan can't write it down. I'm, yeah, I'm writing it. Fucking, that's an RPG. That's another RPG. Don't be like this, Cookie. Pagel! One? Yeah. Eh. Kirby Canvas Curse! Ooh. The Pirates of Darkwater for Genesis. And finally. Ooh, we barely got it. Civilization V. Sorry, oh. Dan, I am so sorry if you did not get I, those in time. I have Civ them all, five? Dan, so... Do you want to count Civ 5? I don't know if it'll let me reroll. Uh, I will. Cogs, I don't know what... Uh, sure. Cogs is a puzzle game, that works. Okay, so we're taking Civ 5 off? Yeah, actually, you're right, that's probably a good point. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you have 10 hours to stream. Alright, sorry. <laughs> Civ 5's off. Cogs is on. Right. Dan, if you need them, I have them all. But I think he oh, had them. Like, I think. Yeah, no, he, the ball. he has Civ Five on there though. It's not so. a big deal. It's not a big deal. I'm very sure it's not gonna be the one that gets votes. So don't worry about it, Dan. If you hear this in time. Uh, I'm just gonna wait a second to see if he actually got that in time, or if he heard that message. Okay. Uh, is this the one we're voting on? Like, it looks like 14 is the one we're voting on. I mean, either way. Yeah, we'll, we'll just go for it. Yeah, vote on the one that he's got there. Oh, man. It's it's like, it's close. Maybe people are miffed about Barbie. Barbie. Yeah, he actually is reposting the correct, the, the first one. With, so it's good. He got the message. All right, yeah, so that's what we're going for. Uh, Tycho is winning. Mystery MAGFest game is behind it. Oh, God, what are we on now? Good or bad? I think we're on good now. Good. MAGFest. We are on good, yeah. Uh, I don't know what game that's going to be, though. <laughs> Final Fantasy 1. Yeah, we're doing yeah. it. No. no <laughs> it could be an <laughs> EA game. <laughs> that would be a good one, but it would be what? very short. Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to say, because then it's immediately going to win. It's that kind of game. It is that kind of game. Oh, man. 
I will tell you, I don't know if you even saw me pick this up. It is a DS game. Oh, I saw you pick a couple of DS games. The second Bomberman X Zero. <laughs> no, I, what DS games did you pick up? I remember seeing you with a few. I don't even. I think only Max was with me when I picked up this one. Yeah, but you you showed off the stuff you bought a couple times. Some of it, yeah. I don't think this is the one I showed off to you. I remember mm. someone saw it and laughed. I think it was Fallsmeyer. Well, I mean, oh, it's close either way. Tycho and Magnus are pretty close. To Somebody just posted in chat. Just played Barbie. Still asked if he's good or bad game next. <laughs> <laughs> Touche. I I kind of might have been in PTSD mode. Just straight up forgot. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> I mean, it, it's. Yeah, I guess you could consider it a good game. I mean, the original game it's based on is pretty good. Yeah. And really, I think it's just the original game, basically, with the reskin. So. Uh, let's put let's put a timer on the clock because it's close again. Cur Canvas Curse is actually really close too, surprisingly. That's why I voted for. Canvas Curse is a great game. I think I voted for Pagel because I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I don't even need to think with Pagel. Yeah. <laughs> I right. I just I love me some Kirby. Minute and a minute and a half on the clock. It's funny like Canvas Curse would come up with like two weeks before the sequel comes out. Yeah, apparently it's already out in Japan. Is it? I think oh. Cobramani already like is LPing it, or someone I is. Some, I love me some Kirby. Civ Five is one of those games where the first time I played it, I was learning how to play it, and one minute then left, eight <laughs> hours went by. <laughs> that that state. Oh my awesome. god! What happened? Metropolitan Museum. Metropolitan said, "If it's Corey in the house, I will laugh my ass off." It's not Corey in the house. <laughs> I, I'm I'm sorry to disappoint. Could have been Corey in the house. God, I, if oh man, if this time, time flux is... just subscribed sixteen months in a row. Chaos King, King one two three six just subscribed nine months in a row. Blasphemy Express just subscribed as well. Wow, three ball and everyone was like nine nine and sixteen. Freak Thank ninety one you. sixteen. Freak. What did you guys plan this? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> All four of you, thank you so much for resubs. Here's your eggs. Disappointed. That is not the egg button. <laughs> <laughs> that is disappointed. I'm sorry. I'm not disappointed in you. Thank you. Uh, Crazy Kenny, five months in a row. Okay, Otto, God. 16 months in a row. You guys fucking planned this. What the fuck? <laughs> they definitely planned Thank this. Thank you for subbing. Um, time is six? up, by the way. Mystery Magfest game wins again by 2% again. Um, you know what? We haven't used one of these in a while. Let's use one of the custom ones that we still have here. Here are your eggs, everyone. You will give me an egg. <laughs> I have a bunch of these. What else do I have? Oops, uh, Windows Media Player crashed. Good job. <laughs> do you do you still have the one I made for your Halloween stream? You will give me an. I found the Waluigi one. That you will give me a. You will give me an. <laughs> I can't find the other ones. I I guess those are the only ones I have saved here right now. Oh no. You will give me an. You will give oh, me an. Wait, wait. Silver Moon just subscribed nine months in a row. Uh, Sith Scythian, sixteen months in a row. Scythian, Silvermoon, thank you as well. Here are your eggs. Thank you for resub. You will give me an. <laughs> you will give me an. <laughs> I'm just gonna play the honk one because I it makes me laugh. All right, Mystery Magfest game wins. It's a good game this time. Um, how do you guys feel about Balloon Fight? Yeah. Now, but is... Balloon Fight, like the old NES game. Mm. Uh, here's the thing though. Uh, the reason I picked this up is not because of Balloon Fight, which is fun. Um, the reason I picked it up is because it's actually Tingle's Balloon Fight. Yeah. You actually uh, play as Tingle in this That's game. That's actually incredible. Uh, this was a Club Nintendo Japanese exclusive that I picked up at MAGFest. Uh, basically, it's Balloon Fight reskinned, so you play as Tingle flying around. I don't know if anything else is different, but I figure it's at least worth a shot. When you said Balloon Fight, the first thing I thought of was Balloons, the old Flash game. And I was like, I wonder if they actually made that into a game ever. I 
To be fair, I also do have Rosie Rupee Land, but I, it's actually on the cookie. Oh, yeah. yeah. I also This is probably going to be a short one, too, the way I see it. So. Yeah, it can't be that long. All right, we're going to break. When we come back, I'll Ooh. figure out where the fuck my streaming <laughs> When we come is. back, another 30 minutes of donations, oh and then God. the game. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hi, chat. I, I have gone down a d downward spiral. Someone asked me, what does water taste like? And I wrote tacos. Oh. I hang out with you people too much. You do. Did I tell you, John, what I... Uh, so, obviously, I have a, a DS Lite now, right? Yes, I've owned a do. DS Lite in the past. You don't have a DS Lite. Oh, no. I'm thinking DSi. I'm sorry. Yeah, you have a DS Lite. And, uh, and I, I owned one in the past, so I had a game sport at some point, right? Mm hmm So I was going through my stuff, my old stuff. I sold most of the games sport. I had, I kept one game and two Game Boy Advance cartridges, right? Mm -hmm. So I kept Elite Beat Agents, because Elite Beat Agents okay. is amazing. Did I tell you what the two Game Boy Advance cartridges I kept were? Mmm. I'm, I'm gonna guess people... one of them is Nintendo based. Yeah, they're they're both they're both Nintendo games. Well, they're both Nintendo based. One is a game, one is not a game at all. <laughs> so one like the health and safety information? No. I have my original, um I bought it brand new when it came out, Nightmare in Dreamland cartridge. Ooh. Which is a which is a great Kirby game. It's one of my favorites. And I own a DS Rumble pack. Oh yeah, I knew the Rumble Pack. Which I'm still, I'm still trying to figure out what the hell I'm going to do with this thing because I think I, I think the only game I have that it works with is Elite Beat Agents. I think the only game I ever played that it works with is Elite Beat Agents. You need to mod it so you can run two at the same time, so you have Rumble Band Hero. I'm, I am good. I the problem is the none, no game support. I think, I think a total of like five or six games support the Rumble Pack. You know, one of the games that supports the Rumble Pack. What? Pacross DS. What? <laughs> I'm no. Pre I'm pretty sure. No. That I'm game's pretty stopped sure. or GameStop. Oh, man. I'm going to have to pick up. I wanted to pick up Cross DS anyways because you've talked about it in really high regards in the past. Ah, oh, now I got to get it. Um, And yes, for everyone in chat, there's a DS Rumble Pack. It's a Game Boy Advance size cartridge. You throw it in your DS and it cuts your battery life in half. Great. Um, and yes, Kirby's Nightmare in Dreamland is a re-release of Kirby's Adventure, which is why I love it, because Kirby's Adventure is one of my favorite Kirby games. <laughs> like the old ones. Shut up. I... Do I have any... The only original DS games I have are Heart Gold, Platinum, and then I have an R4 cart. So... You... D weird legal things that I won't get into. I, I own Band Hero, Line Rider 2... Reflex, MX versus ATV. I own Hello Kitty Big City Dreams because it came with the DS. I I found out. Um, I don't know. I don't want to make John upset. I don't know how he feels about R4 cards. Eh. You can they, use them they, to play MP3s. Yes, they now have a fully functional 3DS R4 card that Which you can also use to play MP3s. Yes, it's. Um. Actually, working with the latest version of uh, the 3DS, which is interesting. Yeah, I've had a lot of people tell me I need to, to play Amazing Mirror. I haven't actually played it. Um, I've heard it's really good. I followed it a lot when Amazing Mirror is about to come out. Um, but I didn't have a Game Boy Advance at the time. I've been sent a file called eggquality.mp3, but it doesn't seem to play. Doesn't play at all. Show original. You will give me an. I heard it. The fuck <laughs> was that noise? I heard it. Was that, um, the, I guess was that some, a Freddy monster scream? I guess somebody in your. I linked it in your chat just for your chat, but I guess somebody sent it to you. Um, yes, that is the you will give me and then five minutes of Freddy Scream. Great. I'm glad I played that. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> oh, you played it through your fingers? <laughs> of course! 
<laughs> oh, Chad just got it. That was. I heard that very clearly over your microphone. You can microphone. thank Starboy for that one. No. Yep, we're, I'm gonna let him have all the blame for that.